hello everyone in this tutorial i will show you how to use traits in scala so traits are uh, similar to interface in java in interface we can declare method and uh, we can define those method in a class which implement those interface so similar uh, in scala if you want to create an interface so this is similar to interface so how you can create it you need to write trait and then name of the trait and let's say in this one we are going to declare one method let's say show this method is not having any parameter and there is no body so we have just created a trait and this trait is having one function without any definition so uh, this trait allow you to define some function uh, you can include some function with definition some function without definition and the property of uh, trait is that it cannot be instantiated you can not create a object of trait now the thing is that how we are going to use trait so for that we need to create a class and in this class we need to extend this trait now if a class extending a trait this class has to define all functions which are declared here in case uh, if this uh, class is not defining all of them in that case this class also become a abstract class and if you remember up from java abstract class is a class whose object cannot be created and now we want to see whether this one is correct or not so we will create a new class we will define our main function So here we will try to create a object of class 2. Let's see what will happen. We will compile our program. So for compilation you can use Scala C or you can use FSC. My dot Scala. So when you use FSC for the first compilation it will take some time but later on when you compile with the same command it will take less time. So uh, here uh, it's showing that class 2 needs to be abstract since method show in trait 1 of type unit is not defined. So it's saying that uh, this class is extending this trait and this class is supposed to define this function but this class is not defining in that case this class has to be a abstract class so we need to write this one now we are saying that this class we are not defining function from this trait and we are making this class abstract so we want to see whether we can create a object of abstract, abstract class or not so we will again compile our program and if you can see uh, it's showing class 2 is abstract cannot be instantiated so a abstract class cannot be instantiated so how we can use this class so the option is that we need to define function from the trait and let's say in this function i'm just printing show function So now I have defined function and let's call that function here. So now there won't be any problem because we have defined the function in the class and then we are creating object of this class. So compilation is successful. Next we need to execute it. Okay. So uh, what it's saying it's uh, my dot main is not static just wait oh 
sorry i actually forgot this one here you need to write actually object uh, because this object actually uh, works in a similar manner as static so this function can be called with the name of my because when we execute our program this method or function has to be called so how this uh, scala environment will call it so using my dot main so in that case this function has to be static and in scala this will provide the same facility so you can create a object this is similar to class but it cannot be instantiated or you can say this definition will be attached only to a single object so now uh, we will compile our program and run it so now this function is caught so uh, thread these are just like an interface we can uh, declare some function and we can define some function as well and in the class uh, we can extend these interface or thread and if we don't want to define function of thread we need to make this class abstract explicitly otherwise we can define those function and we can create a object of our class so uh, in next tutorial what i'm going to explain how to use multiple trait how to make a use of abstract class and other property of trait thank you very much for watching